Hey, what is up, heroes, and welcome back to Small Pokemon Rejuvenation. Last episode, we made our way through Amethyst Cave. Team Zen were there, battled Team Zen, and basically we got thrown into a different dimension. Had to fight a giant Galvantula, which had a demon form, which was uh, pretty difficult. And there's a little Makahita here. Sup? Makahita wanted you inside? Doesn't respect you. Oh, okay. I don't respect you either. I'll come back. I want to gain your respect somehow. Let's go check this house out. Oh, bother. Hi. Yeah! I'm sorry for shouting like that. My name is Samantha. It's just my sister has gone on an expedition to an island called Terrajuma Island and look, she was to be back a few days ago, but she isn't. I'm sorry, but if, you, if you're here to teach moves to your Pokemon, I'll have to wait. I mean, I could do it, but I'm not as good as her, so it won't be as efficient. Depends what moves you can teach them. You need a heart scale. Ah, oh, damn, okay. Kinda sucks. You look kinda suspicious, you're like... Head just looks kind of cool. I've traveled a long, a long way. I think I'll rest here for a while. Okay. An empty house. Where is the Pokemon Center in this place? That's what I need to know. There's some boxes. I wonder if there's like a hidden item in one of these boxes. Could we go click on all of these and no? Okay. Kind of a stupid house. What about this house then. Hey, sup? Sometimes I make sweets. Sometimes I make a little bit too many sweets. Hey, sweetheart. I was kind of home with some rare candies, but my mother likes making sweets. A little bit too much. Yeah, I can tell. Sup? I'm not sure if I should stay in this village anymore. Our leader refused to even show himself. Who am I supposed to follow now? You can follow me. Hey, look at me. I'm your leader now. Haha. <laughs> hey, a little ditto. And my, my sister's boyfriend is always getting lost. What a loser. Haha. <laughs> He's a loser. My boyfriend went out to Amethyst Cave, but never came back. Ah, oh, sure, I'll go look for him. Should be somewhere in there. Just look around. Where could that be? Yeah, I'll probably get him. Probably not, I don't know. Ooh. This guy actually sells stuff. Not bad, not bad. Is this the Pokemon Center I've been looking for? Yes, it is. Thank you. Ooh. Nice and healed up now. Let's quickly go put uh, this Bonsley in the box. Don't fancy using Bonsley, to be fair. Let's go and uh, look around. Oh, hey. I oh, will no longer stand for this silence. Okay, you want to battle? Let's go. Got two Pokemon. Tyrogue. Okay. The forest is dense. Let's go for a flame burst. Oh, you going to fake me out, eh? Not cool, man. Not cool. Let's go for a few flame bursts. And one more. I don't want to gain too many levels because right now I seem like I'm a bit over leveled. But I know when we fight the gym leader, I'm going to gain a lot of levels and I can't get above 30 or they, my people won't obey me anymore. So make sure I kind of stay the level I am. If I can burn this thing, it'd be so nice. Come on, burn it. Critical hit, that'll do. Ah, that's fine, that's fine. I mean, Pidgeotto can just take this out of a uh, gust. Cannot use Frogadier because it's 29. Almost level 30, I mean, two levels and damn, he's not gonna obey me anymore. I'm gonna get out of here, hit one chan. I think this guy only had two Pokemon, right? Yeah. Good. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume the Jimmy is gonna be fighting type because there's been a lot of fighting type trainers around here. So I'm gonna lead off with Pidgeotto. There we go. Ooh, we got Ninetales, what's up? Okay, Ninetales, use will o -Wisp to cut that Medicham's attack in half. Okay. How does it ever try to respond? Oh, there's a breeder there. I guess I can maybe uh, do a lot of grinding. Sup? Hello, Swablu in the air. Do you even know the Sensei? I, I don't. Just Swablu chilling in the air on top right. Heracross. Oh, that thing's going to destroy by my gust. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh, bug bite. Okay. This gust should kill him one hit. Doesn't kill him one hit. Damn. I need to learn like a new flying time. You're like wing attack. I can learn that. That'd be great. No idea what level I learn it though. Like air slash, aerial ace, anything like that. Let's learn feather, feather dance. Ugh. No, I'm alright. My pincer. Double hit. Oh, come on. 
If I had to guess, I'd probably have, like Cypher next? I don't know, Pins the Hero across Cypher just kind of seemed like a trio that would go together. Ooh, revenge. Alrighty then, and. Medicham, okay. Ah, that's fine, critical hit. Yeah, definitely got that critical hit at 4 HP. Oh, let's go to Frogadier. From Water Pulse. Hey, can attack. Can take that. Eat it up and get the Confusion Hex. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Alright, come on. Hurt yourself. Let's go. Hey, this Water Pulse should hopefully finish you off. Okay, nearly finish you off. Leave you like 1 HP. Lucky bugger. And I critical hit you with 1 HP left. <laughs> oh, make sure I've maximized that damage there. Oh wow, we can actually run into the Swablu. What level are they? 20. I don't really want a Swablu to be fair. I got Pidgeotto. That's pretty cool. Sup? Oh, such a peaceful day. If only Kita would stop sulking. Or oh, Keta, I don't know. Kita, Keta. I really want to see how that person's going to respond to that. Uh, I think I could have gone up here. Oh, okay. Oh god, I didn't mean to go down here. Okay, I'll fight this lady. I don't mind. So that Medicham has been will o wisp How is that person going to uh, fight back? We'll find out after this battle. I'll have to go for a few flame bursts. Uh, double slap. Come on. Stop. Stop now. You can stop now. Give me four times. God damn it. I hate moves that can hit like five times. It's so annoying. It's like... Doesn't really do that much damage. I prefer if like it hit like three times it did more damage. Or like maybe two times it does more damage. But five times it takes so long, it's like bam bang, okay. Bam bang, okay, bam bang, hurry up, bam bang. Just hurry up, bam bang, up oh, there you go. Oh my god, it takes way too long, you know? Ah. I'm just really impatient, I guess. Uh, let's go for some more flame bursts. If I can burn these things, it'd be so good, but I don't see myself getting them burned anytime soon. I okay, can burn a flame burst, right? I don't even know. What's the land fling? Nope. Alright, what can you do? Alright, Medicham, kick them in the kick them in the water with high jump kick. Oh, if you miss, you're gonna die. So this is a breeder person. I, these are the people you can keep fighting over and over and over again. So how much XP are you gonna give us? Ooh, Odino, nah, not bad, not bad at all. Let's go for a flame burst. If there's a train like this in the first town, I missed them when I was trying to grind up before. I would have been so angry. Like the first gym leader took me so long to beat because I was trying to like grind up fighting her with um not Frogadier, because Frogadier once I got level 21 it wouldn't have me, but like uh, Pidgey and stuff, it was just so bad. It was so hard, but luckily we got these guys now. I should really you got more audios? Okay, um It's gonna Duskull. Duskull's gonna get Lots of XP when he uh, when he gets purified. It's like no damage, damn it! It's gonna be near light. Just get the XP. I'm going to Frogadier. Finish this uh, Ordino off, and then back into Frogadier. Get more XP and more good stuff. If he has like four of these, or is it three? When he had three or four of these um, Ordinos, we're gonna just grind the levels later. Like, I'll come back here and just keep fighting them over and over and over again. Okay, and another one. And another one. It's got Duskull. Going to Vanillite. I guess a headbutt should live for like 2 HP. Yeah, okay, good. Frogadier, take this. Might quickly go for a potion heal up. I should check how much money I've got as well because when I started the cave last episode, I had like barely any money. But being on the trains and stuff, I should have quite a bit. Now I do not want to die. I do not want to die. Oh, only 20 HP. Okay. I thought the uh, the sweethearts are like 50, but it's like I had some fresh waters. Missed the double slap. Hey, let's go. Some more water pulses. Come on, confuse it, confuse it, confuse it. Or not. Alright, there we go. 
I guess I should go heal up then. Can we go down here? No, it's not down there. We have to go in uh, this place here next. I'm going to heal up, so I'll see you in a second. Okay, we're healed. Let's go see the sensei. And he's not here. Let's go through here. Hey. Oh, look. I have a trainer coming to claim my badge. You're that person from Amethyst Cave, aren't you? But you came all this way to get a badge, right? Pfft, you train us all the same. Because about a little piece of metal. A badge? Worthless. So, does the sensei work for Team Zen then? You probably don't give a damn about my rambling. That's fine. No one usually does. Forgive me for grouping you with other trainers. Clearly there is something quite different about you. But I'll be tested immediately. You want this badge? You have to prove yourself twice. Amethyst Cave is an an incredibly ancient cave. Originally it was underground, but it was uh, uprooted during the Great Catastrophe. Deep within the cave is a secret grotto. To get to this grotto, you must interact with, with a red stone. Once inside, you must bring an item called a bring me an item called a soul stone. Once you bring me the soul stone, then we'll talk. Okay. So let's go back to the cave. Hey, who's this? Hey, you're Voltsy, right? Hey, cool, cool. So you know uh, VNM? Well, she told us that you'll be in need of quick transportation around the region. I'm your guy for that. Don't worry about paying. VNM took care of that. So if you ever need a lift, just ask. So, okay, where, where do I, oh damn it, where do I know we find this guy? If he's in the Pokemon Center, that'll be good, but I don't know where to go, or where he goes. What? What? That's, oh, look, secret entrance here. He's like, yo, talk to me, I'll transport you anywhere. It's like, okay. Where'd you go? So much for that. Oh, there he is. Okay. Oh, he's by a truck. I don't want to go Gearin City. Um. Oh, yes, I do, actually. Right. Last episode, when we looked at, um, Melia's bag, we found, like, her ID card. So I'm assuming if we go back to the lab, we should hopefully be able to find, like, go into her secret, uh, go into her room. A little secret area we can go to. I think we should go down this way to get there. See so what we can find in there. Maybe get some cool items, a new Pokemon. I don't know. She attracted shiny Pokemon. She got like a shiny Pokemon just chilling in there. I can take it. We'll find out. So, how. Where is it? Nope, that's not it. Nope. I don't know where a room is, so. Locked. I want to say it's here, if not then it's somewhere else, but that's the EV training center, don't want to do that. Oh, what, the, what is this? Oh. Switch playable characters, no. Oh, nope, okay. That's kind of cool. So I am... I'm wrong. Okay, I thought maybe well, that ID card we got of hers. Let me look at it again. Card key that was found in Melia's lab coat. Seems a little damaged. Room ID card. Hmm. I don't know then. Maybe she lives in one of the hotels. Okay, so I quickly looked on the forum just before I left this town to make sure that I was correct in saying that this doesn't work. But apparently you can go on the computer and do it. Ah, oh, there you go. Hey, now we can go in. So it's kind of right. Oh, look at this. <gasps> XP share. Nice. Can I, can I take you with me? Can't talk to you. So Wiggly Tough sleep in the bed. So you get XP share. Okay, nice. Okay, I was about to leave this uh, town, go back to uh, Amethyst Cave, but then I thought maybe I'll quickly check the forum, make sure, you know. Well, I see what I can do is ID card, and luckily I did that because I was right. We got a Melia's room. We got a got XP share out of it. So that's pretty good. Uh, question is, where is this guy that transport? There he is. Back to the village. Thank you. So now we're gonna go back down. Need to do that little cycle as well. Find that guy's, uh, that lady's husband or whatever. So I need to interact with a red rock as well. So let's quickly activate a repel to get through here. I have like what? One repel left. Oh god. 
Next we share, let's give that to Panzer. It's got these rocks. It's not it's a blue one, it's not a red. It's a red rock there, okay. Oh, Lunar Toad, hey! I want to see this is the uh, the guy I'm looking for, for that lady. That's a switch out. Things gonna be a pain in the butt to beat. A nice water pulse. Get out of here, Lunar Tone. Sup? Oh, thanks, man. Thanks so much for helping me out there. What? My girlfriend is at home worrying about me? Oh no, I've got to get home. Come by later, I'll give you a reward. Okay. So now we have to go find that red stone. Actually, I'll look at the reward right now, and then we can go buy some uh, repels for this um, this cave. I've always wanted to be running into many, many Pokemon, which I don't seem to be running into right now, which is very nice. That's very odd. Usually I like run into like 50 Pokemon in a short, short amount of time. Question is, what house was it? Wasn't this house? Was it this house? You the? No, that's the mum and sweets. I honestly forgot what house it was. It might be in this house. Thanks so much for saving him. Okay. Hey, dude. Thanks for seeing me back there. Don't have much, but I do have this super awesome movie that we could watch. Hey, we're gonna watch a movie together. Explosions. Thanks for saving me. I can talk apparently. Oh, do you like this movie, Ditto? Oh! Where'd you go? Wait, what? So, Ditto went to a Jirachi and then teleported? What? Okay. So my reward was watching a movie and then a Ditto turns one to a Jirachi, which I don't even get. Oh, I want the Jirachi! I gotta keep it, that would have been sweet. Uh, let's get some repels. Oh my god, they're expensive. Let's get five. I need some great balls. I need some potions. Like, you barely get any money in this game. and. Items just seem so expensive, damn. You get like 50 Poké Dollars for like winning a battle and stuff like normally like 400, 500. It's insane. Alright, let's quickly go and uh, activate Repel. Start making our way through. Really hope we can get that, uh... Jirachi. Well, Ditto. Which I guess will stay in Jirachi form, maybe. So let's go up this way. So there's nothing up here. I assume yet anyway. Probably be something coming a bit later on. Maybe if we get waterfall we can go down there. Alright, just want to interact with these just in case something happens, but no. There's the red rock. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Follow me. Okay. Simple looks kind of cool. There it is again. I've got a pedal on, but I say, I wonder what people we can find around here, but. Some Arceus statues, okay. So, you finally made it. Before anything, I should tell you that I am not Kita, at least not in his physical form. The being you see before you is the manifestation of his emotions and soul. Kita has a, lost, has a lot of darkness shrouded in his past. Every day was another day in hell to him. He could not handle the guilt that was held up inside. So in order to let go of his guilt, he used a secret power located in uh, Shriden to separate us. Thus, I was born into this world and banished to this grotto. What a fool! Devoting yourself from your emotions won't solve anything. 
But it is quite peculiar that he would send a random trainer down here. Has he gotten desperate? Unless he saw something special in you. Tell me, Volti, that Kitty was a member of Team Zen? Hmm, I don't think so. You have no reason to fear us. I believe that the physical Kita sent you here because he still cannot destroy his guilt. Unfortunately, he has too much pride to face himself. Pitiful. Be able to enter here? Then clearly, there's something unique about you. Maybe if you battle Kita, things will change. Fine, it is settled. Okay. This is what Kita asked you to get, correct? Sweet. By showing Kita the way you battle, you should be able to sway his mind onto the right path. They finally put this into an end, once and for all. Okay. This is all over, I request you come back here. Okay, so we go beat Kida. And then we, uh... Come and fight... No, come, yeah, come back here. Not fight him. We might fight him, but... That's pretty cool. This game, I, I love this game's story so far. It's a really good fan game. Almost out. I'm just really curious about that Jirachi right now. Like, I want to know where it is. I want to go get it. I feel like a Jirachi would be perfect for the team. Like, wait. Hey, can we now be purified? Sweet. I think that a, a Steel and Psychic type would be great for the team right now. Right, let's go give the Soul Stone to Kida and battle him. Uh, best heal up first. I don't think I need to. I didn't get to, like a single battle, did I? No, okay, um... Yeah, I think you might be a fighting type, so I'll lead off with uh, Pidgeotto. Alright, let's do this. Sup! I see, just as I expected. Keep that Soul Stone, it should be useful to you in one way or another. I have no particular use for it, but you might as well keep it anyway. But I am a man of my word, I shall battle you. Meet me at the battle arena downstairs. Sounds good. Let's go and do this. Uh, what side am I going on? Not this side. The left side. Let's go win this, shall we? No, not these. Not those again. Get them out of here. They never cease to haunt me. What? Do I have to, like, get these people out of here? Do I, do I need to talk to the... I think the eldest is on the right side. I think I need to talk to her. Maybe we should tell everyone to go or something. Oh, not about the swap blues go away. Kita, you old fool. Just look at what you've done to yourself. You know, if you were more... Uh, Cultured, you know that opponents stand an opposite end. What? Well, I don't know what to do. Since it's the strongest trainer this world has ever seen, I, I, I don't know what to do. Can I soul stone? Oh, I'm an idiot, aren't I? Oops. I know what he means, the Shadow Pokemon. I totally forgot about that. You can't have Shadow Pokemon in gym battles. That's what he means. I thought because, like, you know, he was staying inside all the time, the people watching him were haunting him or whatever, but it's a Shadow Pokemon that haunt him. Sorry, buddies. When I can purify you, I'll definitely be using you, but right now, you gotta send the box until this battle is done. Alright, let's go win this. Forgive me, this audience was uncalled for. However, they are quite inconsequential to our battle. I am troubled. I need this battle to show me what is the right way. I will not lose this. Alita? Alita? Uh, if you would. Sure thing. This will be a single battle with a limit of six Pokemon on each side. First one to lose all of their Pokemon is the loser. Now that has been said, battle commence. Alright, let's do this. He looks like he needs some sleep. How lucha? Ooh, how lucha, eh? Right, let's go for a gust. Gale strike. And it missed! Haha. <laughs> 
I love the Jimmy the music in this game, I really do. To, to be fair, I love all the music in this game, but still. Will a quick attack finish you off? I hope so, but you're probably going to heal up a potion. Yeah, I thought so. Come on, man. Take these gusts like a man! Gonna miss that Gale Strike again. Very, very nice. Oh, critical hit! Get out of here, Halucha! Your time is up. We have five Pokemon to beat here. Five more. I got this. I mean, Pidgeotto should hopefully just sweep this dude. Not with a Rock Slide, though. Damn. Come on, give me a crit. Give me a crit. Oh, we're so dead. And a Thunder Punch. Damn. That's fine. It's, it's still fine. Uh, it's gonna pants here. Go for a flame. Oh, super potion. Seriously. Flame burst. Please do a bit of damage. Ah, that's pretty good. Counter. But it failed. <laughs> Get out of here, my choke. Four more. I still have my ace up my sleeve, which is uh, probably good. I do not want to like burn this thing or anything, cause. Uh, guts. And you do a butt ton of damage. So I'm going to yawn you so that we can just kill your Frogadier. Frogadier is going to have a tough battle on his hands. we will take out three Pokemon by him, or four Pokemon by himself. This one's going to sleep in a second, so that's fine. No kick. Ouch. Got the confusion. I need to sleep. Stay asleep. Can't use cool attack either because I can't go normal type. Gotta stay using water pulses. Pig Knight! Oh, nice. That's a perfect Pokemon for me right now. But I'm at level 31. It's gonna disobey me. And Thunder Punch! Ouch! And you have Citrus Bear. That's fine. You're gonna die now. So you got two more Pokemon, right? Pretty sure. That was pretty much decent amount of XP right there. Right, let's heal up. Hope I'll give a high jump kick and miss. That'll be just perfect, it really would. Fun to punch though, I'm gonna lose this. Oh man, my only hope right now is like, like a crit to kill it or he confuses himself. Come on. Please hit yourself, please hit yourself, please hit yourself. No! Oh, that's so unlucky. Damn! Ah, I thought I had that.
my god, I actually won! Holy crap! Holy crap, I did not think I was gonna win that! My god, I lost this team leader like like 50 times, not even over exaggerate over exaggerating. Oh my god, I can't even speak, I'm so excited right now. Holy crap! I actually did it. Can't believe that. As you saw, I had a swab blue, I got a meditate. Oh my god. Oh, hold on just a minute. Okay, everyone's going. We got the second gym badge, right? Wait, did he give us the badge just yet? Or do we have to maybe go find him again? Uh, yeah, go find him. Damn, that gym was so hard. That was ridiculous. No healing items or anything. Oh my god. Well, I end this part right here. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Well, we're going to chase after the sensei. Peace.